The Federal Transit Administration, investing millions in the low country's public transportation system. $25.9 million from a low no emissions federal grant program that we've had our eye on and uh, we really pitched the federal government for it. Um, it's a really an important step for us as the region grows. CARTA's chairman Mike Seeking says the federal funds will be used in a number of ways. One is to build out the Shipwatch Square Transportation Hub, which is our new transportation hub, which is right on the Low Country Rapid Transit line. Second, it's going to bring us seven new battery electric buses, two mobile charging stations, and I mentioned it briefly, the last thing is it's going to allow us to team with Trident Tech to have an education program for the battery electric future that we have. Because of that future, Seeking says it's imperative that they continue investing in electric and zero emission transportation. Battery electric buses are fantastic, they're efficient, they're good for the environment, they're comfortable, they're reliable, they're low maintenance, they're the wave of the future. Congressman James Clyburn, who helped secure the funds, released a statement saying in part, quote, this funding will make Charleston a model for zero emission transit systems throughout the state and the nation. Seeking says CARTA passengers will benefit immensely from this newly acquired funding. CARTA is committed to providing the best, most reliable, most comfortable, most convenient service that we can to our customers. And this money's $25.9 million. It's an incredible opportunity.